What's up keepers and welcome back to another special episode of ARS Goalkeeping. Today we're going to be looking at the full infield review of the Kona Pure from West Coast GK. A gorgeous take on the previous Kona Biohybrid with a blinding white colorway to make your hands pop in the field. The Kona Pure is a remake of the previous Kona, which I haven't used in a few months so I'm expecting a good show from this pure all white model. The Pure comes equipped with 4mm of German Supreme Latex on a unique West Coast GK biohybrid cut, which combines three different cuts to make a hybrid cut style that no other brand has. The latex is wrapped around the thumb and the wrist strap is a standard strap with 3mm of composite latex on the backhand that has four flex cuts or points for added flexibility and there's also an interesting punching platform that West Coast GK calls the strike guard which is placed higher up on the fingers and as is standard with West Coast GK gloves the Kona Pierce come with fully removable finger saves. Fit and comfort wise it all comes down to the biohybrid cut. This hybrid cut looks a bit massive, something like a flat cut but with a much closer fit and a lot of intricate additions like the V cuts on the side of the gloves for flexibility. I decided to go with a size 9 in these just to get a more exact fit and it worked perfectly. There's a slight bit of negative space on the pinky area, but what I really like is how the outer fingers don't twist in and keep their shape and also flare out. Like I mentioned on the previous Quantum and Kona reviews, the Pure has a pillowy feel once you slip on the gloves while tightly hugging the palm and the fingers. Although there is a good strong structure to these Konas, they are not too rigid. Closing them and making a fist is a simple task in these babies. Next up is the well-known West Coast German Supreme Latex. This Supreme Latex has been setting West Coast GK gloves apart from the competition for quite a while. The grip is insanely sticky, especially right out of the bag, and it can work in all weather situations. The tackiness is exactly what you would expect from a top latex, which definitely led to much surer and solid holds, especially on those stinging shots that come right to frame. Performance wise, it doesn't get much better than the Kona Pures. The gloves hit all my important points with a good comfortable cut and even better latex, which in turn made them my go-to gloves for most game type situations. I never ever felt like the gloves let me down on any save and that led to some of my nicest saves and even my latest best game against the team in Freyden, Germany, where I ended up with a good 2-0 win. Even though the Kona Pure is just a change of color for the Kona Biohybrid, it was a pleasure to have a new pair of these gloves to use. I knew I was going to love them right away, and I ended up using them a whole lot over 3 full months in training and game situations. It was also on all types of fields, especially turf and grass, and in all weather conditions. And because I ended up using these gloves as almost my workhorse glove, the softer Supreme Latex did begin to tear. Which is to be expected, normally once the gloves begin to tear, the ripping and tearing accelerates a lot more. Which you can see here on my weaker left hand side, it's pretty obvious that I palmed the ground either while diving or getting back up, which led to some intense tearing. The great thing about this latex is that the grip still stays strong even under the ripped or torn material. For the price of about 70 US dollars or 55 great British pounds, the Kona Pure is a gorgeous glove to look at and it can work as a training or game glove and even both if you don't have too rigorous of a season. The latex is top quality so it does tear after intense work which is common with all the best latexes. Make sure you get to the West Coast GK website as soon as possible. These gloves are on sale on this moment for 60 US dollars so make sure you get them. I know they're selling out quickly. Thank you guys so much for watching the video. Don't forget to like and subscribe and leave a comment down below. And I'll see you guys again very soon.